Are we rolling? Okay. Rolling. Hey everybody, my name's Jade. I'm the founder of The Green Room, and today we're gonna answer as many questions as possible in three minutes. You guys texted us questions, and we're gonna read your text messages and see what we can uncover about social media, growth, and running a business online. Yeah. All right, so our first question is from Jaren. Jaren says, how do you start a conversation if it kind of seems salesy to someone? This is a really good question. I DM a lot of people and I get really nervous to sound like I'm wanting something from someone. The best way to put it is don't ask them for something. Ask yourself like, how can I add value to this person, right? So instead of like positioning yourself as giving a sales message, say like, how can I add value and position my product as a solution? Okay. Um, the next question goes to Zach. Hey Jade, I'm building my own work community. How do I get traffic on my website? Really good question, Zach. I would ask yourself, who do you want to target on your audience? And then ask yourself, like, what does that person search for on Google? That's called SEO keywords. And then make content around that. And that will get traffic to your website. <laughs> okay, next question. Um, Israel asks, how can you show your customers that they are family? How do you create a loyal fan base? I think it's all about giving people a name, a tribe. Ask yourself, like, what are the things collectively your audience values? Two minutes. If you know what your audience collectively values, you kind of have a shared community experience. So maybe do a poll or Q&A saying, hey, what is something that you value? Why are you here? And then create a collective kind of mantra. I will put a picture later on, maybe in the next video about like how I create a mission statement, but it's super important to have shared values. Okay, next question. We have a question from, why did I make these so small? Um, Brie asks, do you think it's too late to start YouTube? I don't think it's too late to start YouTube. It's too late to start a shit YouTube channel. That's what's too late. Create content that's valuable, engaging, and stuff that's true to yourself. We don't need unauthentic bullshit. Okay, the next question is from Melanie. What's your favorite place to, what is your favorite place to travel? Uh, probably Bali or Paris, so basic. Okay, next question is, Brie, how can you go in depth in journaling to set up your business goals? Okay, so the way I journal is I basically have a quarterly goal. It's too short to achieve something in a month, but in three months, it's way more doable. I'll link it below of how I journal. Quarterly goals are everything. 60 seconds. No! Okay. Um, say happy, Merry Christmas. Keep up the good work. This wasn't a question. Why did I put it in there? Okay, next. Nicole asks, I have 3,000 followers, but my engagement is tanking. How can I save this page? Good question. I think I've... I've been there. I think I'm currently going into the dip. Whenever you're fear, like facing a dip in engagement on Instagram or YouTube, I think it's super important to start asking yourself, am I making content for other people or myself? I think the minute you start to like look at views, it's be typically because you're not being authentic to yourself. Like, are you, are you comparing yourself? Like what I would do is take a break and restart by creating your own feed and creating content that's valuable to yourself. And write down maybe your top five creators and why you like their content. I think you just need more inspiration to just keep it going. 10 seconds, but one more question. We'll get it from Montserrat. Um, how do you focus? Um, I just basically set a timer for 25 minutes. <laughs> All right. Done. Give me a thumbs up. Oh, that was so hard. If you guys want to submit a question, you guys can go text the phone number. And we actually have part two on the Green Room channel. You guys can see the full episode of me answering the rest of these questions a little bit slower and less anxious on the main channel. 60 seconds. No! Okay, go check it in the description box. Thank you for watching Dharma Nation, and I'll see you guys in the next time. Also, thank you so much to ISML for letting us film here. <laughs> All right, that was so stressful. <laughs>